Well, they say that a picture is worth a thousand words, so imagine owning two million pictures and the stories they could tell. And that's exactly what our next guest is sitting on. Daniel Miller is the owner of, get this, two million vintage photographs taken between 1920 and 1990. And he's here to share how you can get your hands on these pieces of Australian history. And Daniel, can you tell us how you came across this archive? Yeah, I received a call, a phone call from a, from a court receiver, uh, gosh, it was about a year ago right now, about a, a collection that became available. And um, I went to take a look and uh, ended up buying it. And it's an amazing snapshot of Australian history right through the ages. Give us some insight into some of the images. We're seeing some of them here on the screen behind us, but what do they cover? A whole range of Australia from the outback to the city and beyond. It really is the entire history of Australia, I think, encapsulated the last hundred years of Australian history. So from the outback to Sydney to every city, every town, every industry covered, really. Have you got a favourite? Well, a favourite would be super difficult. <laughs> I mean, I mean um, the, the slices of time, the, the, the slice of time is just terrific for me. So, so the outback in the, in the 60s mm. and 70s and 50s and Sydney earlier. So this is the entire Fairfax archive. So you, you own the rights, the, the intellectual rights over all this now? The intellectual rights, no, I, I, no. We own the pieces of paper, actually, the physical So photos. you're selling the, the actual photographs themselves? We are. One of our goals is to repatriate as many we can back to Australia, which is not the original intent. These were, and these ended up actually in Arkansas to be, mm. to be digitized for Fairfax, and they got stuck, and they had an uncertain future. Mm. So, so my goal is to bring them back to Australia, and one of the ways we're doing that is uh, tomorrow at Moss Green Auctions in Ullara, uh, there's, a, there's a substantial auction. This is a historic auction, actually, of, I think, 273 of the photographs. So you can own a piece of one of these amazing images? For the first time ever, actually. Mm. For the first time ever that's available now. And uh, it's all the leading Australian photographers, the Max Dupin, Wolfgang Sievers, Olive Cotton, Jeff Carter, Harold Casno. Mm. All, every leading Australian photographer is represented in the archive. It's really a terrific, terrific... Uh, Opportunity. And is Australia at war and at peace? I don't think there's too much in war, actually, but during war time, mm -hmm. there'd be some in Australia. Mm. And they really capture everyday Australians, too. I mean, there's, there's posed photographs, but there's also yeah. lots of photographs of people just carrying on in their everyday lives, and it's wonderful to see it captured in that way. Sure, people being people, and especially in the 1960s, and some of the actual industry in the 1950s, as, as, as the industrial power started to really kick in, uh, in Australia, it's great to see some of that, some of that work. Mm. And the way the face of the cities have changed. Uh, how could I go about buying one of these? Well, uh, tomorrow at 6.30 p.m., the auction begins at the Moss Green Auctions in Wollara. Um, I think uh, people can buy them online or they can buy them in person. I, I would suggest anyone that's interested in, in Australia to, to look at the 273 photos, because mm. truly I had a look at it the other day. It's the entire second floor of their auction room. That's a lot of photographs. Yeah. Well, we have two million. Okay, that's a real lot of photographs. They're amazing images. But, Look at these water hmm. skiers, yeah. the Parks telescope, the whole shebang. It's amazing, yeah. yeah. Choosing these was quite interesting out yeah. of two million, choosing which ones would actually come back. Yeah, fantastic. Well, can't wait to see the results. Well done. Great. Thank you very much for bringing them to us. Thank you. All right. Thank you. Daniel.